harmonizing our external and internal. We are detribalized people, survivors of 506 years of colonization. So much so that even if you do the DNA test and you come back 69% native, your own brother, your own brother will tell you, I'm not Indian. I didn't grow up Indian. What does that mean to me? I'm Catholic. 2,000 years of Catholicism, that's what I am. I don't know anything about Dharamada or Masaba. What are these Tongva people? They look, they look, they look Mexican anyway. They're all nice skin. Mexican or something. Exactly. Exactly, brother. Exactly, brother. Because we've been detribalized. We look alike because all, we're all natives. But the thing is understanding the value system, the indigenous worldview, as opposed to the white man's view. In indigenous culture, whether you're Hopi, whether you're Quechua, whether you're Everyone respects each other's spirituality because in indigenous culture we know that we're all interrelated. The same breath, the same air. You breathe, I breathe, the same gift to the same creator. So it doesn't matter if you call it Kewa, it doesn't matter if you call it Omadeo or Allah or Jesus. We're all this together. So simple, it's so profound, and that's the difference. It's a value system. The value system is about respect, interconnectedness, balance, and harmony. Understanding that what we do today is going to impact the seven generations to come. Honoring the woman nation, honoring the two spirits. Honoring all peoples, all animals, honoring the water that gives us life. Every indigenous culture not only on this continent, but to the Maori and it's so called New Zealand, to the Aborigines, Australia, to the African people, understand the connection. And this is what it means to detribalize, to decolonize, to be detribalized. This is what it means. That's a real, real love thing for us. But it's sad because even your own people, your own family, and your own rel relatives from the north don't acknowledge our connection, who we are. But it doesn't matter because it's all only thing that matters is that we know we are and we're fearless and we and we're fearless and we and we're fearless and I love my little Hello.
and the systems of power that if you're a, a black young man in the streets very likely you, you know your, your parents your family's gonna fear that you're gonna get shot and killed and same thing with us be, the time of the riots during the time of the riots probably before many of you even thought of <laughs> in 92 there was a right after the same division a Foothill Division, there was a, a, a Efrain Lopez who was 19 years old. He was on angel dust, but in his chonies and his underwear with a broom, and he gets shot nine times right after Rodney King and after the right. And there was no, you, and people don't, still don't know about it or think about it or talk about it. But that was crazier, outrageous, like stuff. And it was like, but it's like that happens and it goes unnoticed, right? But that's how come we're all in this together as people of color. We're all in this together and we need to, to unite. And that's why for us, we put out a Black Lives Matter song and also this song, which we wrote back then. And it's called AUG to the Nine. Check it out. Hot Slot Underground. 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 Hot 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 Underground. We got our hands on the back, guys. You think you know we got our hands? 
here in the valley we got no love we had we had to go to east l.a college and that's where we like we started popping out for us like in east l.a college because there was no scene there was nowhere to go there was no it was like a trip where we it was like barren right but we came out of here a lot of people think we're from east l.a because over in east l.a was the only place that we were able to like a lot of got mad love out there so anyway so that was that and then uh what's Yes, we do. Thank you. 
Invitation, but we also have a live band too, and, uh, but Ethan and Joe, uh, you know, couldn't do it tonight. But uh, but we still wanted to support, and we're thankful to support for for healing, you know, for this uh, men's healing circle that that they're trying to fundraise for. So thank you, thank you for everybody. Now our bandmates coming out here today: Robert and Cacho and, and Bulldog and and Pussy always in the house handling. I'm so proud of this. I call him Little Shaman because he's like he's always. He's you always know, got me on check. I'm like, I'm like, damn, man. He's always, he's always giving me, he's always giving me counsel and and wisdom. Like, I'm like, damn. So, anyway, so thank you, little shaman. So, anyway, so, anyway, so, so yeah. but it was okay. So, so this was called decolonize. We didn't cross the borders. Borders crossed us, and uh, we just popularized that slogan. But uh, you know, that's from I think a person named Bersiaga from up north. But um, but it got the song, you know, got banned in Arizona during SB 1070, which was great, which was for us. We're like, yeah, it means we're doing our job. So, and then so racist state out there anyway. So um, so it was called We Across the Borders, Borders Crossed Us. So if you believe in love and you believe in uh, and you believe in Mother Earth with no borders, with no imperialism, and and with us taking care of her and its children, then when I say We Across the Borders, you say the borders crossed us. We didn't cross the borders. Borders crossed us. We didn't cross the borders. The borders crossed us. We didn't cross the borders. The borders crossed us.
Just going our natural way. Thank you all so much. It's nice. It's nice. It's very special that we all came together and um, the team organized uh, a music night and all the bands that came. Thank y'all for your energy, for your rhythms. It's all uh, a shared experience. So now we're all in this together. You know, just living, trying to figure things out. And sometimes like moving our bodies to rhythm really helps us to feel better. So thank y'all for coming out and supporting us. Thank you. 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 Do you want to say some words around me, though? Yes, please. <laughs> Thank you all, everybody. Thank you for staying. Uh, so, uh, again, this is uh, to help the uh, Young Warriors men to go to Mendocino as a uh, retreat, sponsored by Mosaic. Uh, it's a uh, hundred guys from all over the country oh, yeah. hey, come together to ritual uh, ceremony. Yo, so if people are interested for next year. Uh, just stay in touch with us. You know what I'm saying? So I really appreciate it. Uh, hopefully we can do more events like this. Uh, so yeah, thank you. And have a great evening and a safe evening. Oh,